So in the world of Qigong, you have this this idea of qi and stillness. So these are just state of being in our in our system, right? I mean, if you think about how do you advance spiritually, how do you build out your energy field? It's kind of like a a building. You know, you need to have a strong foundation, and then you need to have a strong rooting, and then you need to have a strong frame, and then you layer everything else on top of it, and eventually it becomes this, this wholeness of a being, right? And this is the way that you build your energetic makaba, right? Because people always say, oh yeah, you know, all my chakras are formed and or like I'm in the fifth dimension or seventh dimension. And a part of you either believe it or you think it's all bullshit. Because realistically, how can you go to the fifth or seventh dimension, you know, if your energetic structure is not built? You know, it kind of like, yeah, I'm on, on the 100th floor of the Empire State Building when you don't have a building to begin with. So the mind can be very illusory. So the idea of qi and stillness are the two yin and yang interactions of how you're going to build your structure.